All right, y'all, welcome back. So this is actually big news and it's actually starting to get viral out here on YouTube. So this is another quick update. I know I did a video earlier about this, but the Mexican government actually came out and had their own UFO congressional meeting and they actually brought evidence to this meeting. They have video footage and they actually showed alien bodies. They had scientists and stuff come in as well. And they also had a couple of whistleblowers. They had Ryan Graves there talking. And like I said, I'm going to leave a link in the description below, but this was in Spanish. But they talked about a lot of different things in this uh, meeting. So if anyone's bilingual out there, let me know and we need to uh, get on a live meeting. But this video I'm showing you here is something I've never seen before. You see a UFO and it actually goes up under an airplane wing. And here it is again. I kind of slowed it down. And you'll see this now. If they're faking stuff, that's bad, which I don't think they would come before the public and Congress and kind of fake the stuff in their government. Why these craft were fly flying this close to our commercial airlines, I don't know, but most of those good videos are actually craft flying towards uh, airlines and stuff. And then this, of course, is what I talked about earlier, where they actually revealed the alien bodies are. Um, we're going to call them non-human entity uh, bodies. And you see how small they are. They're actually childlike. Uh, but they actually revealed this at this meeting. Whereas with ours, we just had whistleblowers talking. And then, of course, they couldn't confirm or deny it was confidential. They actually just went all out and they talked about this. Um, and it is in Spanish, like I said. So if anyone has been able to translate, I'd be great if you can come in and do a video or I'll work with you to get a video to try to translate some of this information. But it does look kind of like E.T. Some people are saying it looks fake. But if you uncovered a dead human body that was 30, 40, 50 years old, it looked a lot worse than this. Be decomposed and everything. So think about it on those terms. Try to keep your mind open to this. I'm not saying that this is the, the gospel truth of this, but for them to actually reveal this at this meeting was actually phenomenal. And I'm going to put the link below in the description. I think they start revealing these uh, particular entities around two hours and 15, 30 minutes into the video. But they're letting people come in, take photos of it and everything, which I thought was just amazing that they actually did this at this public hearing. And they had some of their government officials, news reporters and all that. Um, here at this meeting to actually talk about some of the stuff but this was to me the icing on the cake for them to review this and then of course they talked about the history of a couple of things there as well um, it's it's just interesting that they went this in depth at a congressional meeting to talk about whatever it is they uncovered then they actually had doctors kind of come in and talk about you know the structure of their bodies the anatomy and stuff like that which was very interesting like i said i couldn't decipher of course the spanish i tried to but it just didn't work out well but for them to go this far and have this type of information i think is amazing talking about the structure of the bodies their organs and everything in there so like i said i'm beating a dead horse but there's going to be a link below in the description if you want to go over and check this whole thing out it's over three hours long but i do believe it's worth trying to watch and if you can have somebody translate it, that'd be even better. But here it is, doctors talking about the structure of the bodies and what he found there. Like I said, um, I believe this person may have been talking to English. They may have converted to Spanish. They may have lowered down the volume. I'm not sure. I got to look back and see. But for them to go this in depth and have doctors and scientists come in and talk about the structure of the beings that were laid there. Um, I just think that's amazing. That is a huge, huge, huge step, guys. I said that. We're going to get some disclosure by the end of this year. It may not be what you guys want, something landing on your front yard, but it is least we're getting there. And 2023 has been a pretty good year for exposing this stuff. So put down in the comments below what you guys think about this. Um, if I can find more information, I'll definitely put that up. But let's try to get not just this video, but all videos out there that are talking about this. Let's try to get them viral because that's the only way we're going to be able to push this stuff out. Uh, maybe next it'll be Russia or Australia or even over in Europe. Maybe they'll have their own meeting. And it'd be great if all these countries that actually want to get this exposed come together and then talk about this stuff and start presenting evidence like this so that we can see it. Because once this gets out and the public starts seeing more of it, there's going to be a, a more of a demand of what's actually going on. You know, I know there's a lot of cover up with a lot of things, but to see this right here and know that this is going on and we have this, I think this is a huge, huge step. It really, really is. I've seen this particular being in like a museum they had out there before. Can't remember what it is, but I'll try to backtrack and cross reference and give you that information. 
but to at least see this is actually really interesting some people say it looks like it's clay like somebody molded clay or something but we don't know how these things bodies may decompose or what may be shown there but put your comments down below don't forget to like subscribe share this with your friends and stay tuned for the next video